We're gonna go fight this robot. We're gonna go fight a robot down here. Um, Oh, oh, Jedi raised their standards. Hanhar. I thought I smelled something. I told you before, hunt your own targets. Don't scavenge mine. <laughs> what, working for the hut suddenly made you stupid? <laughs> Don't, Han. I don't want your life. Yeah, you're right. I'd rather die than be caught. Hanhar's a scary figure, dude. Like, you get a nice Wookiee in the first one. Uh, like, having a pissed off Wookiee is probably not, like, the most comforting thing. Hey, this droid is here to fuck us up. Let's take it down. I am... Time to take you down to size. Look, before you get into combat, sometimes this planet is just a clean thing, it's not the, uh... Oh! Leveled up. Oh, I thought there was a group of beans here. Okay, don't need treat injury. Okay, powers. Force champ, that's cool. Um, we'll take force deflection two. And we'll accept it. And... Oops, journal. I haven't read any data pads since I got here, like since I started this playthrough, but you know it's whatever. Talk to Foster real quick. You interrupt. You help. Great. We'll go talk to La Savu. Thorian Supremacy League. Something here, gotta do, right? Yeah, so basically, what my I'm guessing the working theory is for everybody is that the Bith with his crazy ears discovered the the cloaking signal for Goto's ship. Because Goto flies around in like a. Uh, cloaked vessel all the time. And, uh... Yeah. Then the exchange found out that the... Bith was, uh, working on it, and, uh... hacked his droids to kill him. Burst to speed again. I like how they couldn't pop up until I came back here. 
So I'll just go down to Ada, whatever the heck her name is, and send her off. Back again. What? What? You've given me. Alright. All the lights I've put. Okay, I'm gonna go here and go into solo mode. I'm gonna cancel. Then we'll go talk to. Oh, Adam's shady backstory coming to life. Da hupa bosakurat. All right. Now we'll go. Actually, the thing I'm gonna do is gonna go to the cantina, get some Juma juice. No, never mind. I'm not gonna do that. Yet. I'm gonna go back to the docks, talk to Lutra, get that lightsaber part, and then. I'm gonna go to take care of the Red Clips people. <laughs> Excuse me, I wonder if I can edit my party. Okay, no, we can't because of the Red Clips people at our ship. Back to the docks. Get this lightsaber part. And then. We can do stuff. Not worry about leveling that up. Because I know people like, have to fight the right person for it. Didn't level him up, but. <laughs> or, which, you know, would be nice to level him up to, like, have him. Oh god. Be capable of, like, fighting them better, but. No, it's fine. Aida, I didn't think I'd ever find you. I can't believe you're here before me. The oh my god, so sweet. I can't even tell you what happened after. <laughs> being shuttled from system to system, barely one planet ahead of the Sith fleet. Shh, we can talk about it later. You have my thanks, stranger. I can only hope you have as much luck at what you're looking for. It's strange you came by when you did. I was right at the edge of deciding whether to give up, turning it over in my mind. And suddenly, you walked through the door and gave me the answer I needed to hear. Maybe you're right. Hooray. Glad I could help. Really am. You know, I like helping people. Oh, I don't want to heal. Whatever. Thank you, jeez. Three clips, everybody knows the rules. Oh, excuse me again. Right, y'all, I'm gonna take a quick break before uh, I fight the Red Eclipse, just to you know, grab something to eat real quick. Uh, but I'll get back to recording some more of this about before the end of the day. So, uh, hope everybody has a good one, and uh, I'll talk to you later. Peace.